Santos was born in 1982 in Cuba and spent his early childhood growing up there in the countryside in economically depressed circumstances. He was interested in art from his childhood and had an uncle who painted. Also, his father had him get instruction in boxing. He relates a childhood memory of going outside when it rained to make sculptures in the mud. His family came to the United States at the age of 12. In an autobiographical video available on his website, he recalls the experience of coming to the U.S. as like receiving an update to what's happening in the rest of the world. Clearly, this was a huge, life-altering leap. He pursued formal training in Miami, graduating in 2000, took more classes, and in 2004, went to Italy to study old traditions of classical painting. He got through that four-year program in one and a half years and returned to the U.S. using old master techniques in his paintings. He later returned to Europe in 2008 to teach in Sweden and also did additional study there of classical technique. During that time, he also joined a boxing club and won a boxing competition. His paintings are full of flesh, figures, both clothed and nude, both male and female. There is a great deal of romance, even romanticism, in some of his paintings, which definitely pursue beauty. The mood is often relieved by humor, which sharpens the erotic rather than erases. He knows the life of the senses. He has a keen sense of the body, of physiognomy, physique, a boxer's sense of muscles. Santos took a logical approach to his studies. He realized that humans have been painting a physical object, the body, that has remained approximately the same in shape since history began, and have been accumulating an entire practice of figurative articulation in a style using oil paints and refined along the way by genius articulators, like the ones we know of, Raphael, Michelangelo, Leonardo, Fra Angelico, Caravaggio, Picasso, Goya, so many others. How does a newly made painting stand in relation to all these works of the past? Santos goes about learning everything he can about classical European originated painting, the true classical Renaissance oil painting tradition. There is an energy and an ambition to this with a certain practical, applied, physical quality. He learned and absorbed all the accumulated know-how about the classical figurative oil painting style that he could. His paintings are riddled with photorealistic or more expressionistic quotes or pastiches of the paintings which are a part of our daily landscape in our image-saturated culture. He understands how painting can not only be about pastoral nature if it is going to reflect what is natural today. We spend our days in a nature which is suffused with prior artifices, prior machines, prior engineering, which now goes along with the real outdoors woods and trees. Somehow, the painting must be about that new nature. All of Santos's choices in subject matter revolve around that fact. Why is it that he is not simply painting a girl walking through the woods? Why must there also be the figure in the hoodie? It is because as he paints his painting, he is thinking about the whole nature, including, sadly, the fear of walking alone in the park.